Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is Friday, July 26, 2019. I am the Drunk Pokeroo. Tis beer time. As I was sitting this morning writing about uh, not getting stuck in a style funk, a style groove, you know, trying to trying to make sure you try a lot of different beers, I just was flipping around, and I, I thought to myself, you know what? I haven't been to Bench in like a year. Bench Brewing, located in Beamsville, about 30 minutes from from the manor here and I thought I'm gonna go today so I was there by 11:30, home by 12 on the deck here at 12 30 gonna get into some beer so this is their latest release in cans the Short Hills East Coast IPA 6.5 percent 40 IBUs um, I picked up a couple of other things again trying to avoid getting sucked in because you know, it's easy for me to just drink IPAs all the time I mean there's variations on IPAs but at the end of the day it's you know I can drink a lot of West Coast IPAs so I picked up um, some of their farmhouse stuff some of their Brett stuff uh, Belgian ale, just to mix it up a bit. It's always good to try different things, even though you have your favorites. Absolutely, I do. You know me and Headstock and, 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 and Bone Shaker and those big, boozy West Coast IPAs. But it's good to mix it up because it helps your palate, A, develop, and B, you don't get that palate fatigue where everything starts to taste the same. But I am excited about this because, you know, I do like a nice East Coast style IPA. A little softer bitterness, a little juicier tropical notes. It's a departure from my normal IPA loves. And you know what? I, and I thought I had a bench glass. And I'm, I'm like, I don't need to buy a glass. I've got a glass. And I get home and I don't have a glass. So IPA glass it is. And that's okay too. It's clean. That's that's the only thing that matters. But, uh, oh. Nice tropical pineapple, peach, grapefruit. I think so. That's <laughs> first step of the day. First beer of the day. A whole weekend to myself. I mean, I got to work. But Mrs. Polk's got away for a sister's weekend. So, yeah, it's just meat and beer all weekend. Cheers. Wow. You know, I've said this, and they have, I think, three beers in the LCBO. Bench is making some exceptionally good beer. Um, it, that's very nice. That is pillowy soft. Wow, that's a beautiful, beautiful texture, or mouthfeel, as it were. Um, that's brem that, that's what the style's about, right? The bitterness on the back is nice and soft, pithy touches of pine, um, but it is a nice grapefruit, uh, peach, pineapple, say some mango in there. That's an exceptional beer. That's very nice. Wow. My goodness. Well, you know what? Again, and today, like, I, I didn't really feel like I need to go out. I mean, I would love to go and spend the day driving around visiting breweries. I just don't have the uh, funds, I think is the word. You know what I mean? Like, you know, you got a budget, you got a beer budget, you got to watch what you're spending. So, I, you know, I got to be careful where we're going there and saving up for some, some stuff we want to do later in August. So, you know, it just, it was an inspiration that just kind of hit me as I was typing away and I was sort of thinking, I need to go somewhere. I just need just a quick trip just for me. And that's what I did today. So thank you, Bench, for being there for me when I needed you. But uh, yeah, you guys should go check it out. It's an absolutely gorgeous brewery. Beautiful. One of the nicest patios in Ontario. Um, the tap room's gorgeous and they've got a, an upstairs patio too, like a smaller patio upstairs. So, I mean, the pictures you can take there are breathtaking. It's so beautiful out in Niagara on the lake and there's a bunch of other breweries you can go visit too. See what I'm doing there? They're giving you a day trip. So, cheers my friends. Enjoy your day. I will see you later because I got nothing to do but drink beer and swim in the pool and then maybe eat some barbecue. Gonna be a good day. Cheers. That is going down really quickly, and I'm okay with that.